ladies, gentlemen, and all those in between. Today, I will be, um, re- redoing- redoing? Today I will be eating 69 oranges, or as many as I can. My goal is to eat as many as I can. Um, I did this about a year ago, and I was able to eat 23. So I have my oranges here. There's actually clementines, which is what I used last year. Anyways, um, also do you like my hat? I feel like it makes me look really stupid, which is why I like it so much. So anyways, I'm going to eat as many oranges as I can. And hopefully, I will not die. Okay, so the first orange, these are all cold. Wait, some of these were in the refrigerator, and they're cold, and I don't like that because I'm already kind of cold. So I'm gonna like eat the, eat the warm ones. This one's warm. Okay. I realized like I don't really put up bring a place to like put the peel, so I'm just gonna like put them there. Anyways, um let's talk about life. Let's talk about life. Today is Thursday. It's Thursday. I never know what day it is, but I think it's Thursday. Um anyways, it's Thursday. Um this is a juicy one. That's what she said. It's Thursday. I keep saying that. It's Thursday. Um, it's December. Thursday. I think it's Christmas Eve day. Yeah. Anyways. Um. I'm not in school right now. That's good. I literally hate school. I think I failed like half my classes. Um, I hope I passed. There's like these two classes that are actually important that I was failing. I hope I pass those. I like did a bunch of work like the last week. So hopefully it was enough. Cause if not, I'm gonna retake it. The thing is, I'm a senior. So, like, summer school isn't really an option because I'm not going to graduate on time. Like, last year I was able to do summer school because I failed math because math is stupid. And I did summer school, which was online because of, like, COVID and stuff. And I passed because... It was online, I mean, let's be real, you know, um. So. Now I don't have to take math. I'm not taking math this year. Because you only have to take three years where I live, and I took three years. I'm not gonna lie though, I do love oranges. Yes, these are Clementines. I love both. I, do they taste different? I don't think they taste different. I don't know. No, they feel different. Oranges are bigger. Oranges are bigger. I don't know. My family never buys oranges. Like, we always buy Clementines. I don't know why. That's so weird that we do that. But then we call them oranges. that's weird that's weird okay yeah that's like really weird I just switch things around a little but we're back um i had four this is my fifth one i had four and my mouth feels very strange like my tongue feels cold but the rest of my mouth is warm i don't know if that's just like me i don't know i don't know anyways this is my fifth one um, do you like my shirt, by the way? I feel like I've only worn this shirt, like, once in public. Because I got it, like, a couple weeks ago. And, you know, I can't really go any places. But look, it has little lizards on it. It's scrubs. Um, it's scrubs. <laughs> I got it from Goodwill. Um, yeah. I got it from Goodwill. Most of my clothes are from Goodwill. Like, all of them, actually. <laughs> I have, like, one pair of pants that's not from Goodwill. And then I have, like, two shirts. One of them was a gift. Anyways. 
Anyways, um, I like Goodwill. Um, yeah. Anyways, what was I talking about? Goodwill. Goodwill, I like Goodwill because, well, I just like thrift stores in general. Um, because, like, my, like, fashion, like, my style is just very, like, you can, you can see. You can see. <laughs> it's very this. Um, and you, you can't really find clothes like this in, you know, regular stores. No. Um, also, I don't really like supporting fast fashion. So, there's that. Um, also, I'm scared of the prices at regular stores. Um, I grew up going to thrift stores like my whole life um wait, 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 how old am I um and then when I the first time I went to the mall I was with my friends and was in like sixth grade or seventh grade I don't know anyways um I went and you know we're walking around and I was like this is a nice pair of pants I look at the price It was like sixty dollars. I was like, "Are you are you okay? Why are we doing this? Why are we sixty dollars?" So I was like, "What? No." So now I don't shop there. Actually, I do have a pair of pants from that store. I bought them. That's the one pair of pants that I have that's not from Goodwill. Um, I bought them recently, like a couple weeks ago, because last year, I didn't remember where, but I found a gift card for that store, like on the ground. And I picked it up. And I was like, mm -hmm. it was in my bag for a long time. Um, but then like a month ago, I got it out and I went on the website. It was Aeropostale, by the way. I went on the website. Or American. No, it was American Eagle. I think that's the same thing. I don't know. It's American Eagle. Anyways, I went on their website to like see if there was anything on it. And there was $25 on it. And I was like, oh. And they were already having a sale because it was like around Black Friday. It was like, I think the day before Black Friday, which is Thanksgiving. Anyways, um, but yeah, so they were already having like Black Friday sales. And then I, I got a pair of pants with the card and then plus the discount, like the sale. And it was like, I think it was like $14 with shipping because I ordered it online. That's a good deal. Pants from there. And they were normally like $60, like I said. Are you kidding me? I'm God. Like I'm, that's amazing. <laughs> That's incredible. I, anyways, they're really good pants. They're nice. Um, they're like huge. <laughs> they're, um, I don't know pant types. I know like three pant types. I know like bell bottoms. I know like boot cut. I don't know like jeggings. <laughs> I know, I don't know. I don't know pants. Um, those are the three I know because in middle school, no, in freshman and like half of sophomore year, no, freshman, sophomore, and like half of junior, not half, like a good, like a couple months, um, I wore only jeggings and then... Now, I wear bell bottoms, mostly. Yeah. What was I talking about? I like, I just know that I was gonna say now I wear bell bottoms and pants. Ooh, the kinds of pants I wear. Yeah, so I wore exclusively jeggings for a long time. In middle school, I exclusively wore PE shorts, like my PE shorts. I would just never take them off. Um, yeah, and then, um, I wore jeggings for freshman, sophomore, and, like, 
two months into junior. Um, and then I started wearing bell bottoms. Bell bottoms have changed my life. They are so fun. They're so fun. Like, why did I start wearing them sooner? They're, they're so fun. They're fun! Plus, they look super cool when you, like, put stuff on them. Like, I have this one pair, um, and I just, like, put a bunch of patches on them. I just, like, leave a bunch of patches and stuff. And, like, they're fun patches. Like, they're fun! Um, but also on the back, um, like, on the leg, they have, like, ribbons. They have like ribbon, I can't explain it. But they have ribbon and it's cool. It looks cool, those are fun. Those are fun pants. They're fun. And then I have another pair that has like flowers on it already. Actually they weren't bell bottoms. They were like weird cut, I don't even know. They were really weirdly cut. Um, and I got them because um, like freshman year my choir that I was in, which I'm not in anymore. We did like 70s show like we we sang 70s songs and we like dressed up like it was the 70s and i bought these pants from goodwill because they looked like they could be in the 70s because they had flowers on them that's it that's the only reason and i wore them for that they were really weirdly cut so i didn't wear them for like two years and then last year i had a moment where i was like wait i could turn these into bell bottoms so i did and they look cool now very cool um yeah anyways that was my fifth one this is my sixth one okay um i feel like i have failed this is my 15th orange i'm gonna finish it i'm not gonna lie i feel like i'm gonna throw up it's not not a good time um yeah okay i think i'm done 15 oranges oh boy okay so that was a little less than last year a little disappointed but also last year I did have the build up. I was training my body to eat 69 oranges. Um, so I would eat one more every day. So like I started eating one. I started eating two actually. I started eating two and then the next day I ate three and the next day I ate four all the way until I got 23 and then I threw up. Um, and then I stopped. So I did have that build up. Um, I'm not gonna lie, I haven't eaten oranges in a while. So maybe that's why my body just couldn't handle it. But, I did 15 and that's more than a lot of people can do. So I see this as a win. I see it as a win. And maybe someday, I will get to 69. I think I will. I think we'll do this every year until I get 69 oranges. I feel like I'm gonna throw up, so I'm gonna go. And I'm not gonna throw up on camera. That's not gonna happen. 